Well, what I want to focus on is an agenda of uniting America. We are so divided. Um, I, I love the comment, uh, and I tell people this, if you think our Constitution is one that is embracing of values of, of rights and, and produce laws that will uh, protect American citizens is not a Democrat or Republican constitution. It is a result of two parties coming together, sharing and debating and, and, and sometime actually scrapping over philosophies. But at the end of the day, we have one constitution. We're one, we pledge one nation under God. And I, I just hope and what I'm going to work for, we always talk about working across the aisle. I think it's more than that now. I think it's about listening to each other and respecting each other. Um, I, I, I so want our economy to recover. I want America and, and Oakland County to get back to work. I want us to be safe. I want people to stop dying in America from a virus. And I think we can chew gum and walk at the same time. I don't think we have to just pick one side and just stay in our corner. I think we can come together because I don't think anyone wants to lose a loved one or to suffer in a hospital from this virus. I don't think anyone wants to sit at home unemployed. I don't think it's one in lieu of the other. So we have a lot of work to do. Um, from the way things look, our Senate is going to remain the same. It'll be a Republican majority. Um, it looks like we'll maintain the majority in the House, and who knows who's going to be our president. Um, but America continues. This is an, an election and a democracy. And I will say to everyone listening, regardless of where you stand on your values and your beliefs, we must all be locked arm in protecting our democracy. Voting, counting the votes, and accepting the results of the election.